Welcome back. This is your daily tea time here in the North Woods. J Lo, Neo, and Derek Huff will judge some of the best dancers in the world starting tomorrow night right here on NBC. Let's have a look. I always get excited for a new season of World of Dance. We are back, and I couldn't be happier. Having a front row seat at the best dancing in the world can't go wrong. <laughs> Every single year, there is some huge surprise of talent. You are all of the wonderful things of the world. They come from all over to show that they're the best in the world. What we're looking for is the perfect combination of great choreography, crowd appeal, technique. Maybe it's all of those things rolled into one that will ultimately be worth a life-changing million dollars. Let's go! I am so ready for this. I love dance shows, especially World of Dance, because it this show brings the best dancers all up from all around, and they compete right in front of some of the best dancers in the world. J Lo, Neo, and then Derek Huff. J I mean, J Lo can break it down. Can you imagine how long <laughs> it takes to practice these kinds of dance moves to be on, to get on a, a TV show like that? A lot of practice, yeah, a lot of dedication, and you gotta have the passion and the, and the will for it. Um, again, J-Lo and uh, um, Derek Huff. Derek Huff is, is the brother to Julianne Huff, and I would say they're the two most famous like s siblings who are you know dancers in the world. So to be able to actually spoke with Derek the other day to find out like what makes this season four so different than the rest. So let's hear what he had to say. All right. Uh, another thing that's pretty special is uh, World of Dance Season 4 with J-Lo and Neo and you. How excited are you for this? I'm so st I'm so excited. Um, it's it's awesome. I and mean, Season 4 of World of Dance, it's different than any other season we've had before in the past. You know, we, we have often said in the past, you know, what an accomplishment it is just to make it to the World of Dance stage. And this season, we're showing what it takes to make it to the World of Dance stage. And the audition process, and we're stripping it back to really show the grind. And um, it just makes for some really different moments that we have not had on the show before, something different. And, you know, one of the things we're doing actually is that for the first audition, um, we're kind of surprising the contestants. We're surprising the dancers. They don't, they don't know we're going to be in there. They think they're coming in for the last audition with, for the producers to make it to the show. And they're going to walk in, and there we are waiting for them, and they're going to have to dance straight away. So uh, we're kind of testing their nerve. We're testing their ready-at-any-moment mentality. Um, but it's, again, it's going to make for some really exciting television. He was really cool to talk to. That is really cool. You, got, you get to talk to all these celebrities. Know, I'm kind right? of jealous now, right? Jealous. Oh, it ain't no thing. Oh, stop. <laughs> <laughs> no, but Derek was great. We were actually going to do a Skype, but for whatever reason, um, I couldn't hear him. He couldn't hear me. So we just did a phone interview. Again, he was great, and he really explained what's different about this season, how they're putting in a lot more surprises because a lot of sort of reality talent shows like this, you kind of see the same thing yeah. over and over again and you got to switch it up. And they were lucky enough to uh, pretty much get through in the entire season before COVID-19. Yeah, I was just wondering oh. about that. I'm like, obviously they taped this all before this started, but it, you said most of the season. Most so that's of the good. season. So I think the the finale. Uh, it, he said, Derek said it was a little odd because the finale was probably the only episode that they filmed without an audience. Mm. It'll give me a chance to have a new show to watch since Law and Order <laughs> <laughs> isn't filming anymore. <laughs> yes. Okay. So World of Dance begins uh, tomorrow night at 9 p.m. right here on Channel 12. You don't want to miss it.